at about 6 p.m. I think 6.3 or 6.4. 1.4 billion Indians skipped their heartbeat for a second when the Chandrayaan soft landed. A feat never before accomplished by anyone or any country. I remember Nyananda Kaudadi Lair, it was a working day. We normally sit till 4.30 and because of the crowd, because of the uh, number of cases I had, I had to sit at about 5, 5.15. It was just uh, last or one hour of my sitting. I was so impatient. I think the lawyers and the staff of my court were able to understand that. Perhaps they did not realize why. chambers I wanted to turn on the television, which was a smart one, and uh, therefore we had access to the internet. What a moment, really, what a moment it was when the Chandrayaan landed. What expertise, what precision, unbelievable. I mean, we feel very humble. Look at the brilliance that we are now uh, surrounded by. We are nothing. If you see, if you scour all the information that you get, they're extremely simple, down to earth, and uh, completely without ego. They work with kind of a mechanical precision. And Karna is simple. They work with the cosmos. They are aware. This world is a cosmos. Then what are we? Nothing at all. They are the people who understand astronomy and cosmos like nobody else. So we've always seen Namala television images Kandal Pol in the Manisla. What are a routine item carrying on Arkan over Namaka Tonu Engilim? You should have seen our order to them faces, our eyes, Indur focused item, Indur determination and our Manisla Nolam, Namaka Kana and Sadikima. And it is Fulfilling that uh, many of the uh, most brilliant engineers today we have in India, the most brilliant scientists, come from this college, and this is my hometown also. I am also born and brought up in Anaki. opportunity <laughs> 1.4 billion Indians Dr. Unikrishnan He is only leading the pack. Every one of them are important. But I believe that uh, there are students also, and uh, I am sure you are all proud today. But each Chandrayaan ne peti namla Apart from the technical things that we are talking about, forget about the technical things. You are all engineers. You can read it and uh, uh, understand it. There are some things which are unsaid. Now, we talk about Chandrayaan 3, but we rarely talk about Chandrayaan 2. And the Karnam, Namal Chandrayaan 2 failed Chidu Nana, Namal Darichu Chirikin. Other Abadda Dharanayan, Karnam, in the doctor Unikashana, the confirmant Chidu. Chandrayaan 3 was possible only because of Chandrayaan 2. Adahemano Parna, Chandrayaan 2 will then the Kitia information, particularly about the South Pole of Moon where nobody has visited yet. Ah, images and the information Chandrayaan 3 is a precision or good So then how do you say Chandrayaan 2 is a failure? Chandrayaan 2 is not a failure. It was a complete success. But this is what I think a young student should be always aware of. Normally success and failure and the bar completely perceptive one. It is something that is in your mind. It is not something that is right. Normally end on a failure and the bar in the failure. That is actually a precursor to your achievement in future. This is the greatest takeaway of Chandrayaan 3. And I remember uh, when the Chandrayaan 2 did not make a soft landing successful. I remember the way the, uh, the uh, head of the ISRO reacted. He was very down, very crestfallen. I believe he was even crying. That is a normal thing because our despondency with all the effort that you have taken, our despondency about the Sangharo Namak Epur that is why Chandrayaan 3 was possible. So Chandrayaan 3 the inputs and the Muran, Chandrayaan 2 will not get images on them. Adil Namuk Shagari can cut them, other than extrapolated Chiyan Sadikina, inputs on the Nolada and the Nature Milakari. This is the greatest lesson in life for us. Uru Muriletta and the Varena, Uru scientific title, Uru achievement of Matramala. 
It is an achievement for the human intellect. This is the dream that we are now having. This is a dream of 1.4 billion people. But the second takeaway from Chandrayaan is this. You can dream for the heavens and the Varanam volume. Now we are dreaming everywhere. Imagine from the moon, I'm sorry, from the sun to the outer space, to the moon, to the earth, and to the uh, seas, ISRO has reached everywhere. We have the Aditya, we have the Gaganyan, which goes into the outer space in 2025 or whatever. We have the Chandrayaan, and you have the Samudrayaan. So the uh, ISRO has reached everywhere. There are no limits now. From the sun to the outer space to the moon, earth and the deep waters. So we are we are everywhere. ISRO is everywhere now. So this is what really now makes you. It is to dream. And that dream is not something that you see when you are asleep. It is that which keeps you awake. It is that dream that makes you awake and keeps you awake. And not what you see when you are asleep. So this is all that I am capable of, I can reach in the takeaway. This is the biggest lesson I thought from Chandrayaan as far as uh, uh, we are concerned, particularly the young students are concerned. planning. Meticulous or execution. These are all things that really should inspire us wholly. Because anything that you do, what really guides is the manner in which you prepare for it. Pandaro Parayolo, measure twice and cut once. So either the TV flying object to boy, parana boy, soft land science fiction please understand the amount of information that was that was analyzed the amount of time that was taken to put this in uh, in that in that perspective and that really is what chandrayaan is all about chandrayaan is all about foundational basis on the now, I am a lawyer, I am not an engineer. But I must tell you, I had joined the REC as a student after my plus two. And the mark was So my exposure to an engineering course is for about 20 days when I was in a college in an engineering and then I dropped out to join law. Because my ambition was not to be an engineer but to be a lawyer. Without a scientific temper and engineer. Scientific temper and the number of constitutional obligation. The Chandra and the moment of the Varayan, the Satyam Varnayan, it is a time when the world woke up to India, really. You know that Chele Valare derogated a cartoon or international magazine and the details like a Katakala. We answered it with a slap. Those people who carried all that had no words to say in a, in a moment's time. 604 or 603 on the 28th of October, August 2023 was a game changer. And imagine, Adindaru input on the it came from Kerala and mostly from South India. The ISR was led by a South Indian parochial at some side. But I'm just telling you, for those students who think, this is an answer to you also. If you have the commitment, if you have the division, if you have the uh, the dream, anything is possible. Aditya is possible. Pandaro Parnadu Vole, you know, vision without action is a daydream. And an action without a vision is a nightmare. These are the takeaways of Gaganyan. Gaganyan, the information now is being used by the world. I'm sorry, uh, Chandrayan. The Chandrayan information, three Kurukan information is used by the world. Yesterday, one of the uh, teams from USA found that water in the uh, moon is because of the fast piece electrons that is on the plasma sheet of India, of the world. Look at the kind of information that the world is getting from, uh, from uh, Chandrayaan 3 now. This is the international collaboration that takes it forward. So this is the importance of what we are now witnessing. And this is possible only because of the extremely eminent uh, women and uh, uh, gentlemen who are sitting behind me now. We cannot thank them enough. It is their uh, vision, it is their commitment, it is their industry that has now made us all so proud for having me here 
it's been a great honor and i reiterate i feel extremely extremely humbled today i am nothing in the feeling ullu divasamana and it is my greatest pleasure and privilege that you have hosted me today and i remain indebted to you for all times to come thank you for your exceptional patience thank you very much